Hello everyone, welcome to Course Class. I'm Dr. Greeson, and I wanted to take just a few minutes to introduce myself to you guys, especially for those of you who are doing virtual learning right now. Uh, on a personal note, I've been married for almost 23 years to my husband, Philip. We have a son, Carter, who is 13 and is in the eighth grade this year. We also have a fur baby, Blue, uh, our dog, who is a Husky Lab mix. He's got beautiful blue eyes. Um, I've been an educator for 23 years now. I began my teaching career at Lee University in Cleveland, Tennessee, where I taught voice and diction. In 2006, I decided to leave Lee and started teaching at Murray County High School in Chatsworth, where I taught chorus, piano, music appreciation, and also special education. Uh, you may have noticed that I introduced myself as Dr. Greeson. No, I am not a medical doctor. Uh, I cannot tell you what that rash is that you've got on your arm, but I did go to school for a long time to become an expert in vocal performance. I have a doctor of musical arts in vocal performance from Shenandoah Conservatory in Virginia. I also have a master of music in vocal performance from Indiana University and a bachelor of arts in music from Berry College in Rome, Georgia. Uh, that's a little bit about me. Hopefully we'll get, you'll get to know me a little bit more uh, as we all get to know each other uh, this year. And I can't wait to get to know all of you. Uh, I know the circumstances are a little out of the ordinary because of COVID-19, but we're going to make the best of it under the circumstances. Um, right now, uh, the school system um, has a policy that says we cannot sing indoors. Um, singing actually disperses a whole lot more aerosols into the air uh, than just when we talk. Uh, and unless we're wearing a mask and all of that, they just didn't want us to have to deal with all of that. Um, we can't do sing indoors right now. I'm working on some other ways for us to sing virtually, which means if you're a face-to-face -face student, uh, when I see you guys, we're going to be doing some other types of things in class uh, during our time together. I have some other interesting lessons that are planned for you guys that I think you'll enjoy working on at school and at home. Uh, please be sure to log into your Google Classrooms uh, for Chorus. You should have a Chorus class already in your Google Classroom. If you do not, let me know uh, so that I make sure you can get that code and get into that class. Um, I will be posting assignments in the Google Classroom each week uh, for you. Uh, if you have any questions or if something comes up and something's going on and you're, you're having trouble with technology or anything, please don't hesitate to contact me. Uh, my contact information is in the interactive syllabus that you'll find in the Google Classroom, as well as on uh, my Google site. Um, hopefully, um, we will be able to sing together uh, this year, but for right now, we're going to find in some other ways that we're going to do that. So any singing that's done, you guys are going to be doing that at home and you'll, you can record that for me and send it in to me and I'll give you guys feedback on that. So we'll have some different, you may have some assignments that aren't actually you singing. You may have some other things going on, some other little projects that we're working on, but you also are gonna have some singing projects as well, where you'll be recording yourself and sending that in to me. Um, but I'll let you guys know more about that as we get into things. And this first uh, week of classes, uh, we're gonna be talking about, I'm gonna do a little presentation on just some basics uh, about your voice and what your vocal cords look like and things like that and do uh, teaching you guys some basic warm-ups that you can use at home uh, because it's important to get your voice warmed up before you start singing so that's going to be some of the first things that we're going to do and again if you have any questions please don't hesitate to ask um, you can, again, my information is in Google Classroom and on my Google site. I also am going to have a remind uh, that you guys need to sign up for, and probably that's going to be the quickest way to get in touch with me if you need to get in touch with me, because there's the text function on there. As long as I'm not in class or working with other students, if you send me a text, I will get back to you as soon as I can. Otherwise, email is probably going to be the quicker way to get in touch with me. But I'm so glad to be here this year. I'm new to Southeast and I'm so happy to be here and excited to get to know you guys. So goodbye for now and I'll see you next week.